Fly Dream Ecuador says, I got a question for you. Why is it recommended to have a higher amp rated ESC when using higher voltage? In theory, when applying more volts, the current consumption goes down. Seems counterintuitive. I, I'm not sure where you're getting that recommendation from. I would say, in general, the harder you're going to work the ESC, the higher the amp rating you want. So, yes, with a higher voltage, the current goes down, except oftentimes it doesn't, because you're assuming you're pulling the same watts. So what happens is, if you had a 2300 kV, let me get the math right. If you had a 2300 kV motor on 4S, and you went from 4S to 6S, the equivalent RPM would be 1500 kV, roughly. So you would go from 2300 kV on 4S to 1500 kV on 6S. You would have about the same watts, but you would have a higher voltage, so you would have lower amps. Yay! Except that's not what we did. We went from 2300 kV on 4S to 1700 kV on 6S. So now we're pulling more watts, and our current draw actually stays the same or goes up. So you do see the same thing when going from 6S to 8S. If you have um, uh, 1800 kV, what is 6 out of 8? This is 75%. Um, 1800 kV on 6S times 0.75 would be 1350 kV on 8S. But we go to 1500 kV or 1600 kV on 8S. So what we're doing is we're taking advantage of the fact that we can draw more power with less amps to increase our RPM and draw more power. Why would we want to be more efficient when we can have more power? <laughs> so the net result is we actually hammer the ESC harder because the voltage is higher, so the FETs are running closer to their, their limit. Well, it depends on what FETs you spec, but... Uh, and the ESC is actually dealing with more current, not less.